What's happening guys, Charles Salisbury here. Thank you so much for joining me as ever. Today is a bit of a different one. I want to chat to you about a shaving cream. Now, it might sound weird as a hairdresser talking about shaving cream, but I have done my barbering courses and I do wet shave as well myself. And I just wanted to say that I've actually found something that is fantastic. Uh, I have extremely sensitive skin, um, a very dry skin. You, like I say, I wet shave with a, sh with a razor and I find this fantastic. First of all, I find their scent amazing, but mostly it is the feel of it I love. It's very jelly. Uh, what that means is you can see, it's completely disappeared in my hands. What that means is you can see very easily where you've shaved, where you've missed. The razor glides over it. It does foam up a tiny bit if you get your brush into it. Added to that, it is vegan, it's GMO free. The product is totally recyclable. Um, they're an Austrian brand. I came across them I first of all came about from the moisturizer and then I got their shaving cream and their deodorant. Their moisturizer, I've since found better ones. Um, I don't really talk too much about this channel about skincare, but if you'd like me to discuss a little bit more about what I use on my skin, I mean, it's not that great, but, but I can do. Um, this was more the hair removal side, so there is a link there somewhere. So yes, I do use their deodorant and I do use their shaving cream, which I find fantastic. Um, so yeah, moisturizer, okay, if it works for you, it's great, but it didn't work for me. Like I say, I have very dry skin, so I needed bio oil, actually. I just put bio oil on my face each day. Um, they're a pretty healthy brand. They're a pretty good brand. They're pretty forward thinking. I'm a big fan of this. Something a bit more natural or vegan, just because I think we should be moving that way anyway. I personally am not vegan, but I use a lot of vegan products because I think we'll, Cutting down is better than not cutting down. Um, so yes, I'm very excited by talking about this. And like I say, they've not paid me. They don't even know I'm doing this video. So as a guy, if you wet shave, I would start moving away from your foams anyway. They're very abrasive and you can't really see what you're doing. They kind of get everywhere. They feel quite nice, but really they're not doing anything. They're not adding the glide. Something like this, for example, you can already feel the slip of the glide that it gives you, which is great for that razor. It's great to glide across. Um, and just the idea of it is to add less friction. I don't think foams do that as much as something like this does. If you're using oils, that's great. You just need to make sure you wash your face afterwards quite well. Uh, this sits somewhere in between, so you can still get a tiny bit of foam out of it, but mainly it's just the glide that I like about it. It's not that cheap. But I also think that if it's on your face, it shouldn't be that cheap. Uh, we've discussed this to go full circle with hair. We've discussed this with shampoos and conditioners. Most people will say spend more on your conditioner than your shampoo. I completely disagree. I think it should be the opposite. I think anything that goes in your skin should be better quality than anything that goes in the dead ends. Um, so save money on your conditioner and spend a bit more money if you can on your shampoo. Don't go crazy, but just anything that touches your skin should be a better quality. That doesn't necessarily mean better price, but just make sure it's a better quality. And with that, I want to say thank you so much for watching. If gents' uh, skincare is something you want to talk about a little bit more, like I say, as well as being a hairdresser for 15 years, I have done all my barber and wet shave qualifications. I like, am more than happy to do more videos on this. Um, as well as the hairdressing stuff and with that please like and subscribe if you are interested in more in anything hair related and I'll see you soon. Take care.